I learned how to drive without like a driver's permit. So you do it at night and nobody sees and nobody knows. So my earliest driving lessons were at night. Okay. And I and I got to to appreciate Dude, what it is to drive me. at night. Is that Chuck Lou? Wait, who is that? Is that Chuck Lou? Holy crap. Hey, Chuck Lou! Chuck Nice! What the hell are you doing down here? What are you doing down here? We're going to oh, the Hayden Planetary. Okay, wait, come here, go. Hey, okay. where are you going? Right, right, I'm okay. going there too. Okay, all right. Then again, that's a dumbass question. That's He's an okay. astrophysicist. <laughs> where else would he be going except that's the Hayden Planetarium? <laughs> Obviously. Hey guys, Neil, what's up? What are you wandering the streets? Where, where are you going? I'm just headed up to the Planetarium. Cool. Yeah. Nice day in the neighborhood. So, I'll, so you need, I'll give you a lift. That's where I'm headed. That's and that's what he had it, but I think he's lying. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me tell you, you yeah, walked yeah, in yeah. while I was saying something to Chuck oh, oh, okay. about when I first learned to drive. Uh -huh. All of my dr earliest driving lessons were at night. Oh. And what was interesting for me about that is I learned that almost anything that matters, not entirely, but almost everything that matters is either reflective or self-luminous mm -hmm. at night. And so when driving at night, it was a much purer experience for me. Oh. Because think about it, in the daytime, You're distracted there's, a, there's a building there, but why should I care? Yeah. I just want to be safe on the road. Yeah. There's, there's stuff out the left, out the right. But when you're driving at night, it is the distilled essence of, your, of, the, of the path that you've chosen to get from where you were to where you want to go. As long as no deer come out of the forest, <laughs> well, well, <laughs> which is where I learned to drive, where they're actually deer, right? So they should have on, on driving, on the computerized driving uh, simulation, uh, simulation yeah. they should have deer, you know, jumping. Just darting out at all times. Just darting out, yeah. I, I yeah. hope they do. You know what I heard? Someone told me about whoa, whoa. some calculation that was done. Uh -huh. they, s <laughs> <laughs> so they said, I mean, it, you read the article and say, this can't be serious. And then you look at the data, all right? So it's, you know, as you know, in the suburbs, in many suburbs now in the country, deer are like suburban rats. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay? Yeah. They're everywhere and... I have, a, I have a friend, and this is, I think it's awful, but uh, shoots them with uh, the paint pellets oh. to Re get rid of them. Really? Yeah, but it's, for, for whatever reason, you can get those pellets without actual paint in them. Oh. So... Oh, no, they should, no, leave the paint on them. That'll just be embarrassing. <laughs> Your deer get back. Oh, you got a deer coming home. I got Man, shot again. What happened to you? <laughs> shot again, huh, Donner? <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> just, you got to cause social embarrassment for the deer. That, that's the only real way this will work. Uh, and so, uh, so what they did was they said if you introduce mountain lions or some kind of sort oh, of medium-sized cat. Okay. That will take down the deer. Uh -huh. That will help reduce the deer, the deer population. population. Wait, just wait. It'll also okay. reduce the child population. No, no, wait, wait, no, no, no. So here's what you find: <laughs> the mountain lions will eat some people. Yes. Some older people who don't run fast, mm -hmm. and some little children that could be snatched from a yard. Okay. But that number of people who you lose is smaller than the number of people who die each year by hitting deer with their car. Whoa. Okay. Okay, but that's the total, right? If you introduce mountain lions, you're only going to get the population of deer down to some level because balance of nature requires that right. there are at least some deer still around to right. feed. Predator, well, yeah, predator yeah, yeah. prey. You right. got to have. The, so there's a. There's got to be a circle of some, life. <laughs> <Akuna> Matata. <laughs> he lives in you. <laughs>